I'm back from traveling and I have so many bug bites. I'm telling you, Floridian mosquitoes, they're just built different. I don't know what type of sorcery, venomous juices they have within them. These bites are insanely itchy and intense and it's been like three days. I need it to stop. My skin is on fire. Send help. <laughs> Welcome back. What's up guys, it's Ange and today, oh, today we are in for a treat. You may not think it, but oh, I am very excited to film today's freaking video because one of my favorite animated films, apart from the Kung Fu Panda trilogy, is Storks. And when someone goes, ooh, what's like a really good, funny animated film? You don't hear many answers being Storks. But let me tell you, it is my mission here today in this video, during this commentary, to prove to you guys, even though you guys aren't asking for it, but I'm gonna prove to you guys that Storks is just a top tier, like legit god tier of an animated comedy film. That, that's pretty much it. That's We're gonna dive right into it. Before we begin, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all of my content. I post three times a week. Follow me on all my social media. All my handles will be in the description below. And follow me on Twitch. I live stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Alrighty, y'all. Let's jump straight into the commentary. For as long as can be remembered, storks delivered babies. In case you guys didn't know where babies came from. It was our duty. Our core belief. Aww. Oh gosh. This was our challenge. Plus points for reality. No matter how tough or impossible or brutal. Sure, delivering babies is probably not the best. I am over adversity. Oh god. Bruh. <laughs> Something about Andy Sandberg, like, immediately narrating is just brings a smile to my face. How can you not smile from him? God. Thank goodness we don't do that anymore. <laughs> Delivering babies is probably a nightmare for sure. Like, think about it practically wise. Our new phones! Storks deliver packages for cornerstore.com. Yes, also known as Amazon. Storks is the Amazon in, of this world. Love to see it. Oh my god, he just did a lip bite. I can't. Perfect landing, chicken check. The camera work. Nothing like the slapstick humor and the camera work of this freaking animated film. The wife and I are celebrating another anniversary. Good job out there, brah. Thanks, Pigeon Toady. How is he a pigeon? <laughs> like, he has, like, Donald Trump hair. Look at her! Look at her! She exists, brah! Do you guys hear about Roger? Ha! Are you okay? Wah, well, hey, brah! Hey, boss wants to see you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so good. We all have one of those. We all have a pigeon toady in our workplace, you know? Universities, high schools, we all have one of those. Yeah. Junior! <laughs> You know why I built my office entirely out of glass, even though birds can't see glass? Ooh, uh, why? Oh, ow. Power move. Power move? It's a power move? is literally just to inflict pain on others. Means you are going to be named. Boss. <laughs> that's, so, that's so funny. Cool, 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 very cool, very cool. And then the typical Andy Samberg, cool, 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 very cool, 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 cool. Bro, the head explosion thing. Legit, the like this movie is a meme. It's one big meme and it's great. That's the type of humor that I love. The Orphan Tulip. What's up, Orphan Tulip? You know why we stopped delivering babies? Because there are so many other ways of getting babies? As in one way of getting babies. I guess there's like two or three ways of getting ba- Maybe like four or five ways of getting babies now, but you know what I mean. ...and tried to keep a baby. Tulip's beacon broke. My baby. The orphan Tulip has just turned 18, which means we can finally liberate her. But she's no trouble. Oh, she isn't, is she? 
Here's our profit chart. The peaks are when Tulip is on vacation. God. The valleys are when she tries to help. The only thing you need to do to be named boss on Monday is liberate the orphan Tulip. If I'm not being clear, I mean fire her. Oh, oh, oh no, why, why? No other way to make it clearer that the boss is the bad guy. Orphan Tulip? Yes, Orphan Tulip? But you never talk to well, me. Well, yeah, that's changing starting today, Orphan Tulip. Oh, I, I, I love how he- Orphan hurts my heart. That, I have orphan hurts my heart! Legit called her Orphan Tulip three times. No, no, that's a quail, an emu, there's a chicken, they cannot fly. Until now. It is still a personal victory if you use the bucket. I'm dead. Will not use the bucket. Wait, what? I'm dead. There's a bucket for the birds that can't fly. This is gonna go great. We all know this is gonna go very fantastic. I go back! Oh. No, that's my place. Oh, and of course the chicken screws it up for all the other birds. This is my moment. <laughs> oh my god, the chicken's voice actor is great. He's like, this is my moment. <laughs> The chicken is literally me. I'm fouling. <laughs> we good? We good? You good? Are we good? Oh god. Oh god. Oh. I'm sorry. She literally blew up the entire place. All I want to do is help. Oh. <laughs> the chart and the music it's just like a subtle type of funny it's not gonna make you rolling on the floor laughing but the way that they like even just frame this shot where they like have her in focus and she's like oh i'm so sorry i don't mean to and she's like really being super genuine and apologetic and then in the negative space in the back it shifts onto the boss and then focuses on him and he's right there as well with the freaking profit chart that was mentioned in the scene earlier that's what makes it freaking funny i just love that i love that i feel like it's like they really push to make it just funny in every single moment that they can. That's just the nicest, you know? It's like a little rainbow. Of course, it's her birthday. You are... What? Me. I hate confrontation so much. Excuse me. You're fine. Animation team. Fantastic. So good. I just blew up most of the factory. Yeah, you did. This is the most appropriate time to fire her. She blew up the entire place. It's totally reasonable that she would get fired. You are the new head of letter sorting. <gasps> this is worse. Putting them in an apartment that doesn't exist. That's so mean. Oh, she's so cute though. She, she wants to try her best with everything that she's assigned to. Bird, bird. You hear about Steven Gloria? What? Oh my god, she's playing all the freaking workers. Are you guys talking about us? You guys better not be talking about us. Dude, she's playing the entire department. She's creating a story in her head. I have like a hundred different versions of myself as well. You can't fire me. I just did. Wait. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean that. Guys, group hug. Group, group hug. <gasps> so sad. I'm hugging myself. I'm about to launch the assault. <laughs> Dr. LaFreeze. <gasps> this kid is so cute. I'm not alone. Ninja Force, attack! Ninja Force? <laughs> he's pretending he's getting defeated by all these toys. Ninja Force, tell my wife I loved her. Oh. Boy is so cute. I can't. A house is not a home without a gardener. That's Jennifer Aniston. I'm pretty sure that plays the mom. It def. It just sounds like her. You didn't show up. Now he controls most of Western Europe. Ethnic tension is on the rise. Ethnic tension's on the rise. This kid. I literally played house when I was like like his age, and all I did was like play either the mom or like the dog. That was my play pretend. He has like a whole complex story in his brain. Love this kid. Wish I can be this kid. Love you, brother. It's like we're best friends that live together. True, my sister's my best friend. House, Kyle. What we were saying, like They're advertising their own freaking business on the side of their car. Oh, I want to show you guys again. Watch the turn. Gardner Realty. I'm dead. 
I've decided I want a baby brother. I think we're fine as a family of three. Keep your eyes on the road. Where to get one? <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get me? <laughs> oh gosh, here we go. But we have you and that's all we need. The dad's voice actor sounds kind of like Kristoff from Frozen. Maybe like an older version of Kristoff, like the voice actor, I mean. But they sound so similar, just me. For delivery service. Tell me this isn't the cutest thing, though. Our adult names are Henry and Sarah. It is our adult belief that it would be irresponsible if this baby did not have ninja skills. Sincerely, adult parents, Henry and Sarah Gardner, comma, adults. Like, if you found a letter of, like, a little kid being like, hey, can you please send me a baby brother, baby sister to the store? Because that, that's freaking adorable. That is, like, cry-worthy of cute. I'll travel back in time, and then, Nate, you can write all my college essays for me. If I don't deliver the letter, I won't be doing my job. Oh, cover for you. Okay, thanks. Loopholes. Good job, Tulip. Monday, it'll all be yours. Bruh. <laughs> Dude, those tiny birds should be dead. Hey, what are you doing out of the room? I told you not to leave the room. Okay, we need to get out of here. Yo, your feathers are kind of like knives, bro. Hey! Oh boy. You done did it, Tulip. I think it was supposed to go over there. You're right, that was wrong. What? The letter physically becomes the baby? I don't know how I feel about that. Put the oh gosh, there. oh gosh. It's literally the stupidest thing, but of course. Ayo, great. Oh god! Wing is done, bro. My hopes of becoming boss destroyed. Oh. Infant babbling, so cute. Oh my god, this is one of my favorite scenes. Come cool, bro. It's a game, game last night. Not too bad by the last quarter. <laughs> yeah, that was too bad. I got them with a little, little five left. left. We pull it out. <laughs> Only to lose it again in the last second. It was a come down. Only to get it back. A roller coaster of a game. <laughs> All right, two, to lose it again. again. What a game. Cool, never game. <laughs> Wait, Wait a second. second. There was, was no, no game, game last, last night. <laughs> That's comedic genius. Whoever wrote the script, oh my god, 10 out of 10. And then on top of that, the the voice actor, you can't tell me that's not funny. Look at me, look at me in the eye and tell me that wasn't funny. You wanna laugh. You want We do not open that thing. Just a brief exposure to baby cuteness can ruin your life. Remember, Jasper? Hmm, I'm trying to put my finger on it. You're being sarcastic because you changed the course of your life. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, the mumbling. A great way to deliver jokes. Witty, fast-paced. Oh, that's, that's nothing. Legit, a flying vehicle. Great, I'll use it. Oh, I'm saving it for something else. It's my dream to deliver packages for cornerstore.com. <laughs> She's lying. She's definitely lying. You for the what? baby. Yeah, you can use it. Let's deliver this baby. Are you sure, though? Well, uh... All right, let's do it. <laughs> Why are you gonna say, are you sure, and make her doubt? That's literally the worst. Whenever I'm asked anything, specifically like places to eat, I'm already indecisive. But then once I actually like cr like make a decision, I'm like, I say a place, and then they hit me with the, are you sure? No, I'm not sure. But this is the place that I've settled with, and I'm internally dying because I've had to make the decision. So here, okay, never, never are you sure somebody who is already indecisive, unless you want them to uh, implode because that's what happens to me. Okay, great, let me show you how to fly this. I'm a bird, I'm pretty sure I know how to- <laughs> <laughs> Of course, the autopilot button, that makes perfect sense. But what makes you think that you can fly something that someone else built and someone else invented? What? Nate is adorable. I don't know how old he is, but considering he even made this cute little ladder thing. I love your school encourages oh. imagine. Okay, just kidding. It is not as sturdy as I thought it was, but the determination that he has. Love it. Okay, all right, fine. You blink and I'll be in college. What was that? I, I didn't say anything. <laughs> hey. Nate's no, 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 the baby felt like one minute ago. What? Nate's so cute. And his voice actor is incredible. We love a capable kid character. Ah! 
something about Pigeon Toady or whatever his name is just makes me laugh every time I just see him. What can we expect from Boss Junior? Oh, you know, that's top secret. He has no idea. I know. If you don't know, then why do you want to be boss? I know. You don't. <laughs> nice try. I am programming you to tell me why you want to be boss. Oh, God, he hates this. Back off! <laughs> on her for a second don't ask me why i want to be boss right <laughs> what's your idea of success what's your idea of growth what will make you content in life and why so I can't take it. I'm so oh my god at least have junior like take the steering wheel <laughs> Nice, nice. Good one, Tulip. Good one. You had an autopilot feature. Why didn't you just hit the autopilot button? Why didn't you turn on the autopilot? What? That's what I said. Hey. He's quiet. The baby is quiet. The baby is quiet. Why did you say anything? Oh, no. <laughs> God. <laughs> baby murderers. <laughs> Literally dangerously cute. You're breaking up the team? Team? What is wrong with you? <laughs> What is wrong with you? <laughs> what is wrong with you? <laughs> Tell me! Like, like already so on point with just the jokes and they're on point with the voice acting because it already sounds funny, but just to put in the extra effort to make and choreograph the movements of the freaking animations is so good. It's so good. And it makes me laugh every time. <laughs> ah! What is wrong with you? You and I are not <laughs> This is all your fault. This. <laughs> All of this. The funny thing is, it's not even her fault. Like, you're the one that didn't even fire her. You were supposed to fire her, and then maybe this wouldn't have all happened. Oh my god, my one of my favorite parts. Like, this whole sequence with the wolves, my favorite. What are you gonna do? Knock me unconscious? Of course that's what happens. Of course that's what happens. Listen, I'm the alpha. I'm gonna eat this thing first. I'm gonna be the- Oh, Key and Peel. You. You're not even a beta, huh? You're not even a beta. <laughs> <laughs> what just happened there? What? What did that thing just What's do? That? The pupils like dilating. Ah, I'm gonna bite her arm clean off. <laughs> <laughs> you can't help the cuteness. And look at you. Look what you did. I did the same thing you did. Are you in love? I am in love. Are you in love? I'm in love too. I agree. I agree. I agree. I agree. I apologize for what I'm about to do. Ow. Oh. The best plan ever. I can fake it. I can fake it. Okay, okay, fake it. Ow. Oh, Junior. Wait, hold on a second, okay? Wait. Junior, you gotta realize that all of your plans have not been working out thus far. Like, everything you say that is gonna work, doesn't work. Tulip is literally carrying the team. I can't. Poor Junior getting the brink of it. Do you want more? Yes! She's literally hyping up the crowd. What an entertainer. Love it. And that fake out! You've been duped! Oh my god, my biggest nightmare. I would never walk through a bridge like that. Wolf Wolf pack. Form, Form of Wolf, Wolf Bridge. Oh my god, it's so funny. Whoever thought of this is a genius. What is happening? The wolves are forming a suspension bridge. How is that possible? I don't know. It's stupid! But it's so funny. I'm not gonna deny that it's pretty freaking dumb. It's genius at the same time. Wolfpack, for wolf boat! The wolf boat! Are you kidding me? That is so unpredictable! <laughs> Wolfpack, for more submarine! <laughs> bing, bing, bro! <laughs> the breath! The breath! Oh my gosh, it's so good. I don't know who thought of that in the writer's room. Yeah, I had an idea about this scene. They're gonna run into a pack of wolves. The wolves are gonna get distracted by the baby's cuteness via Tulip hitting Junior. And they're gonna run and they're gonna chase them across a really sketchy bridge. They chop down the bridge. Tensions are rising. The stakes are high for the wolves because they need the cuteness. They need the baby back. I propose that they create a wolf bridge. They're gonna co They're gonna literally compile together to form a bridge and then they're gonna the rest of the wolves are gonna go across said bridge furthermore chasing tulip and 
Junior down. That's going to be a pain to edit. Like, if I was an animator and I heard that, I'd be like, hell no, I'm not animating that. Are you kidding? It happened. It got approved. And it ended up being hilarious. That's the type of risk that is just so rewarding on, on screen. It's so funny. God, oh my gosh. It doesn't fly. What? It falls. Let's go. Wolf, play. <laughs> they almost had it. The wolves almost had it. You're gonna destroy the whole roof? We have to replace the chimney with a slide for when the storks deliver my baby brother. True. This is the best time I've had with Nate in my life. Aww. No baby brother shows up? Then we tell him. We can get a new chimney, but we'll never be able to replace his time with Nate. Let's go, Dad! Moms are fun, too! Yeah, they are! Oh, I love it! That's not a well-made chimney. I think I could nail one on a chimney. You see this? You see these these arms? Oh my God! What if I got some like you know like discus throw? If I had some momentum? Oh God, I'm dizzy. La 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 lulu. Oh, Junior is bonding with the baby. This looks like a good place to rest for the night. What are you talking about? I, Why I can't hear what you're saying? Why? He literally popped the raft just so that he wasn't proven wrong just so that his motivations are still in the right place oh really why do you want to be boss of corner store i don't know okay why does anyone want to be boss oh the baby's hungry she's freaking eating all these sticks jasper destroyed my homing beacon i lost all the pieces <laughs> except one you sacrificed your plane for this baby she doesn't want the baby to go through what she went through didoy you can name her really diamond destiny Diamond Destiny. Huh. What is it with a hum up? I feel like parents in theaters or parents watching this movie just could definitely relate to this moment. Oh my god, my favorite part. Oh. oh. How do you like me now? How do you like me now? How do you like me now? If it was a time, I just love me so. I can do no wrong. And now you need to know how like me now, how like me now, how like me now. The subtitles, oh, just like the extra detail is so good. Tell me that this movie is not legit, like the one big meme. When I tell you that I sung that song, like I redid that scene over and over again, days on ends, no, weeks on ends after I saw this movie for the first time, like that is just, I wish I recorded every time I did it and made a huge montage. It would be at least an hour long, at least. One human sees a stork with a baby and will get reported. <laughs> Why is she doing that? Goodbye baby on the treetop. Nope, what does she want? She wants you. I don't know if she's reaching for you. Maybe she just wants you. So dramatic. No way he still didn't check the freaking corner. Oh, leaving. I don't know, come on! Of course those are the wolves. Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that the wolves like pretended to be a box. I didn't even know that that was what it was. A wolf minivan? They made a freaking baby seat! Oh my god! Just go slower. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Tiny thing license plate. Tiny thing? Oh, we lost her again! Glass. We love a good bird joke. A bird can't see glass! Straight, straight, left, right! I'd be so bad at this. <laughs> Little the last one, him spamming it. What are the chances of that? I guess pretty high in a glass factory. Classic. Uh, him hitting that last piece of glass over and over and over again before realizing that maybe he shouldn't go that way. That's me gaming That's any game. Ooh. It's Jasper. What's up, Jasper? I fell in love with you. Honestly, I am very curious. Let's hear it. 
Always deliver. I failed to do that. Your beacon broke. I spent my entire life searching for the missing pieces. Oh, Jasper. But I have pledged. Oh my gosh. To be Wait. the parent I took from you, Tulip. Oh my God. I have a missing piece. Excuse me, what? Imagine spending your life trying to find that last piece and she had it the entire time. No way that beacon is functioning perfectly just because all the pieces were stuck together. Imagine I just smashed my phone and then, but I put all the pieces together and it's still working fine. No way. I'm gonna finally meet my real family. <laughs> you know what's so funny is just then when you said real family, it like weirdly hurt my feelings. I realize how stupid that is. I mean, I Junior. We are a team, okay? We're gonna deliver this baby. I was mountain. supposed to fire you. The truth is out. So sad. The layers to this too. Goodbye, little girl. Bye, Diamond Destiny. Oh no, the team is all broken up. That's depressing. Junior also clearly cannot do anything without you. So this is gonna be very funny. Come you done? Hmm? Oh boy! Here we go, Josh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look, 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 look. This is not the code. This all has to come down. The hat is so deceivingly long to make it seem like it's a beak. You are so idiotic. How are you not suspicious? I'm dead. Who's the baby now? No, don't let the penguins take Diamond Destiny. They don't deliver babies. Not anymore. Why did we do all this stuff? Because they wanted to spend time with you, Nate. I can't get over that the cop was wearing a baseball cap. Flap is all the way out to here. I can't. I can't get over that. Are you okay? The reaction is just one long gasp where she's just like, <gasps> How can we get back to the corner store? What are you doing? Oh, I see. You did that so we could hide in the box and get back to corner store real quick. That's right. Genius! Return to sender! Oh my god. Stork con! The biggest stork convention- The stork con narration, please. No. What are you doing? We have to save the baby. I'm just a huge fan of stork con! Shouldn't it be like corner store con? Gumi? Hey- Oh, she just fully winked at me. Hey, I'm filming right now. I'm watching birds. Are you okay with that? being so sassy brb guys i'm gonna go hang out with gomi really quick <laughs> she's so sassy i think she literally just wants to hug me for a little bit okay i am back played with gomi ate some dinner reapplied some lip gloss and now i'm back <laughs> give me back my baby oh i love the scene put down that baby as little noise as possible oh my god it's so funny <laughs> i can imagine a whole theater just laughing their asses off at this scene and that's the only noise that you would hear because there's no sound here a convenient box of bells <laughs> i love the penguin so much first time i watched that i was wheezing what Oh. Oh, cutie. Come one step closer, <gasps> and I will drop this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hand over the baby. You can still you can be still boss. Be. <laughs> it's not working anymore, bro. I hate how the freaking, what's that thing called? The punching bag in the back of your throat? I hate how it's like <laughs> vibrating. Oh, I hate it. Junior, you're actually s crazy. You're making like a million babies. It's gonna be an overload of freaking cuteness and probably poop and pee smell, but also a new baby smell, which is actually quite nice. What kind of witchcraft is this? Oh, that's not dangerous at all. 
Bro, we really be cooking up so many different babies. Just me, but not a single baby ugly? I, I don't want to hate to be that person, but not all babies are cute. Oh god, what are you gonna do? What was he gonna- <laughs> That escalated so quickly. What were you gonna try to accomplish with your little drone? No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. We could go on like this all day. I'm just gonna go on and destroy the baby factory. <laughs> oh god. Oh, oh gosh. Diamond Destiny single-handedly just destroyed the boss. Why is a corner store literally being held up by threads? What kind of architecture is this? Now get over here and get me out of here. Yeah, you would've thunk. Don't move. <laughs> My V is for Vendetta. That's what you get for being an awful person, dude. Goodbye. Bye bye It's not gonna, like, you know, harm civilians, right? Holy... Jasper to the rescue, question mark? I forget how they survive. Oh, wait, oh <laughs> it was Junior? He's, he's using his broken wing? There's not an ugly child here. How are none of them crying? The thing is, one of them starts crying, you're screwed. Cause then they'll all start crying. This is so cute. I absolutely love this. Since we met, I feel Ugh, and the indie track in the back. They got all the cliches. When you can't fall asleep. I wonder if animators like have a New York City base animation. And they like recycle that for other movies because there's no way they reanimate that every single freaking time. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, they got the sentimental and emotional aspect too right at the end. She said. Oh my god, that camera shot out of the trash can, so good. What a satisfying ending to this freaking movie. My heart. Oh, this is so cute. You did a good freaking job, Junior. You just gave her an entire life and a family and a home. I love you, my little lady. I ordered a brother! You want to feed her a bottle? Ninja skills. Yeah, who's complaining that she's a girl now? Okay, you're feeling I'm not feeling. <laughs> Healthy. I have no feeling. I love the banter of those two characters way too much. The moment of truth. Let's go, Tulip. We're all right behind you. All the wolves are there too. What the hell? They all look like her, I'm dead. Even the cat is a tabby. Mom and dad? <sighs> Isn't it great that she has like such a big family and they all knew that it was like her? Ugh. Where are you going? Get over here. Junior, you're a part of the family too, dude. Aw, Junior. I was looking up. Is this the Lumineers? Oh my gosh, this movie just got 10 times better if they use Lumineers in their soundtrack, bro. <coughs> Bless me. All right, if this commentary didn't convince you and make you want to watch this movie on your own, I don't know what will. Even got the sentimental and emotional factor too. Really loved it. Little stuff like, like storks delivering babies is such like a old like concept that you just like grew up like learning about and seeing that one idea 
tumble into this huge story. It's always so fun and that's what I love about movies and that's what I love about stories in general and bringing them to life on a, t on a screen um, to make a big spectacle out of it. It's incredible and I really hope you guys enjoyed this movie as much as I do. I seriously crack up to those scenes, especially the wolf scene, Pigeon Toadie scenes, and freaking the penguin scene at the end. Those are one of my highlights and I literally to this day, I like me now. Hope you enjoyed watching with me. Thank you guys so much. And if you did enjoy this commentary, make sure to leave a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't yet already, so stay tuned to all my content and don't forget to check out my last video. Alrighty y'all, have the best day ever and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, okay bye, okay bye, okay bye. I also just wanna say thank you, thank you, thank you, Thank you so, so much for 25,000 subscribers. I am so grateful for you guys. Hopefully I'll be getting to 50K before the end of 2021. I'll start off 2022 with 50K of you guys watching movies and TV and traveling the world with me. With that being said, I have a vlog out right now my Orlando trip. If you like my vlogs, make sure you leave it a thumbs up. It really helped me out a lot. I would love to mix my content in here and do more vlog stuff because I do plan on traveling a lot. So yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Peace. <laughs>